Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, my name is Zion. Okay guys, so before this video gets started, I just want to let you guys know that if you're looking at this video for guidance of any kind, definitely don't. Um, my form is definitely not up to par, and even when I was dancing, it probably was not up to par. Um, I don't want to offend any dancers with this video. There's definitely many amazing dancers out there on YouTube that you can watch instead of me if you're looking for guidance or looking just to see what dance is supposed to look like. But if you just want to see me having fun and, you know, trying on my point shoes after I think three years now, then keep watching. <laughs> but today I have a very exciting video, but first I want to say thank you guys so, so much for 100 subscribers. That is crazy. 100 people. So for 100 subscribers, I decided I'm going to recreate one of my most popular videos, which is trying on my point shoes for the first time in two years. So I think at this point it's probably about three years. So basically that video did get a lot of attention and I really honestly don't like the way I edited that video and the way that I was speaking in that video. Like I just don't really like that video. So I decided to recreate it, especially since you guys got me to 100 subscribers. So first things first, somebody in the comments said that my shank was too hard. So today I'm gonna be, before I start, I'm gonna be trying to break it. Okay guys, so I have my point shoes right here. These are Capizios, um, they are size 10. Right now my normal shoe size is a nine and a half. So hopefully this will still fit, honestly. I don't think my feet have really grown much in a year. I think I'm pretty much done with my growing and stuff, so I think these should still fit just fine. On the back I do have my, my left shoe and my right shoe, because you know, I guess they wanted us to do that like in case they, you know, your feet are different, like they're not the same and stuff, like if your arches and stuff. And then I have my little toe pads or whatever. This goes between my big toe and my little toe beside it because they do kind of cross over a little bit and honestly we don't want that when we're going on point. Oh, that's what they call, they're called spacers, I just remembered that. And then I just have my little toe pads. I think everybody gets these just to protect your feet and then Oh, here's my little sewing kit. They taught us how to <laughs> sew these strings on. Oh gosh, this is, I need some strength for this. But I'm just going to hold this for five seconds. Let's see this shoe. I think these are as broken as I can get them. Now I'm going to go ahead and do some warm-ups that I think I used to do. I'm going to do five of these. Now I'm going to do five tondus front and five to the side. I think that's pretty much it for the warm-ups without my point shoes on. So I'm going to do those same exact warm-ups with my point shoes on. I got my spacers. But again, these just go between these two toes. Then I'm going to put my toe pack on. Put my right point shoe on first. Oh gosh. They feel a little tight, but they're not too bad. So I'm going to tie them up as I remember. I'm going to pull on the other one and I'll come back. Okay, so I have my point shoes on now. Here how they look. The left foot definitely feels a lot smaller than the other foot. I'm gonna go ahead and do my warm ups. Do the same warm ups as before, so let's do this. It looks like I'm not even trying to point my foot, but I really am. I think now I'm gonna go on hardwood floors and try this. So my toes are already. Okay guys, so I'm on hardwood floors right now. So definitely when walking down here, they were really tight on my feet. Not that I noticed, I didn't really notice that before, but now I do. Okay guys, so I found a little corner of our dining room that I can use. So let's go ahead and start our fellow day. Oh. Okay, I think that was pretty good. I do want to try to go on full point though. Whew, I'm just as good as I can get. So first, I, mean, I guess I can try to balance and point my toe. Ooh, I can barely balance and do this when I'm not on point. Uh oh, I'm gonna do this like, okay. That's not bad, but I'm obviously holding onto the wall for dear life. That is my attempt at that. Not the best, but you know, we do what we can. We do what we can. So, let's do stupid rays. I'll do it towards this way, like going this way out of the So first, I'm gonna hold on for dear life. Okay, not bad, it really hurts. Ouch. Now I'm going to do grump up mods, which are pretty easy normally, but I'm gonna do one point too. So let's do this. Love this. But yeah, that's my grump up mod. Let's do one point. Woo woo. Okay, that's honestly not bad at all. It, did, it hurt pretty bad, but like not too bad. 
I only have a couple more to go and my toes are killing me so let's do this okay guys so I think the last thing I'm gonna do is something that I did in my last video is where you go like out and in I literally cannot remember what that's called I'm literally not even going on full point at all and it still hurt really bad and I literally could barely do it. I guess that's it for this video. It was very painful and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if there's any other techniques or anything that you want to see me do on point or with dance or anything like me trying out. I do have a video of me doing my last dance on point and it wasn't the best. I only did point for about half of a year. I guess that's it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it and thank you guys so much again for 100 subscribers. I love you guys and I love creating content for you guys. So I will see you guys next week. Bye!